Hello everybody, my name is Kitten welcome back for a new series, Kenna Bridge of Spirits. Now apparently this game uh, looks very fun, it looked very fun uh, when I discovered it boys and I wanted to play it for a long time so much so that I actually bought it in advance like a month ago in something like that by accident because I thought it was gonna come out a month ago and it actually got uh, delayed as soon as I, uh, I paid for it which is fantastic but uh, still, I still think it's going to be a fantastic game. I, f I believe it is supposed to be like uh, an RPG, but not really a full-on RPG. It's more like an adventure type of game. So we'll see how how it goes, boys. We'll see how fun it is, how much fun it is, and stuff like that. Different uh, type of art style. So I'm really excited to play this game for you guys. I've obviously by now decided to drop out on Deathloop. Uh, so I'm not sure if I already recorded my last video or of Dep Doof or not a Death Loop or not, but I'm so uh, like I've been super tired of that game. It was so hard I couldn't complete it, boys. So I decided to at least put a pause on it or like uh, maybe I'm gonna return it to it eventually. But for right now, I'm putting a pause on it and I'm kind of focusing on my brand new game, which is Kenna. So let's go ahead and do it, boys. Let's go for the options, games. Uh, difficulty, story mode, spirit guide, expert. I'm gonna stake on story, or story mode, boys. I'm not good at games. You already know with death loop and everything. I don't wanna have to rage quit on another game. So a button legend show. Yeah, whatever. Controls, camera sensitivity. We can keep it like that, I guess. Graphics, performance mode. Sure. Audio and everything seems fine to me. Uh, subtitles on night mode. Reduces the range between the quietest and loudest so uh, sounds. Oh, really? That's interesting. No, I actually want uh, off that. Uh, I want that off. Music. We are gonna drop that super low, just in case we get any trouble with copyrighted uh, stuff. And uh, that's uh, that's gonna be fine as it is. Let's jump on it, boys. Unique wooden marks are gar gay uh, garved to honor the dead, placed in scarred uh, sacred shrines. These masks gradually return to the dust, symbolizing the spirit's peaceful journey to the next life. Not all the uh, spirits can travel this path alone. Struggling with tragedies of their past, they linger and become dangerous and everything. So on and so forth, boys. You guys can read that if you want. Look at those graphics. This game looks beautiful already. I'm gonna shut up now. Balls. All right, let's find out, boys. Boom! What is this? All right, look at this game. Look how beautiful it looks. This looks beautiful as hell, boys. I don't know if you guys see the difference. Uh, maybe it doesn't render as properly with uh, the YouTube video and stuff. But this on my console, next gen, boys, new gen and stuff like that. It looks fantastic. It really does. You already know how to jump. Is there? Oh, there we go. So we can dodge. Pretty much the same thing, mostly. All right, let's go, boys. Let's jump on it. I can sprint as well. Yeah, this game looks fantastic. Holy shit! All right, what is this? I can already tell, but this is going to be a different type of game from the usual ones we play, which is why I wanted to play it in the first place. Felt like I really wanted to just get the hang of it like get a uh, get a, a different type of game to play it look fun and uh, I just want to play some different games from time to time you know make it a bit different there's multiple of them right here not sure what that means are they ghosts or whatever are they dead people uh, can we go into the water we can actually swim which is nice let's, uh, let's see really quick what is this so I'm not sure what this is right here boys but um, uh, I can't uh, jump or attack it or anything. Yo, she does backflips, boys. Look at that. Woo! Backflips and everything. She's fantastic. All right. Uh, let me... Uh, yeah, there we go. Let me uh, make sure that the light is on for everything. We gotta find out uh, how to get out of this cave real quick, though, boys. All right, let's go. Now, who, uh, who might this be right here? Our first boss or something? I hope not. The 
This is my home. My village. Turn back. Spirit guide. Well, first boss fight already, boys. We just started. Alright, so light attack. Light attack and that's the heavy attack. Okay, so that's the light attack, obviously. Boom! And heavy attack. Alright, so it's obviously going to become a lot tougher uh, in the long run. This guy is gonna, keeps respawning or something, boys. Alright, let's go. Get him. You already know in these types of fighting, boys. Boom! Let's go. We're going to uh, select our Taru style, of course. In these types of fighting, you already know. Alright, so how do I... Uh, they want me to dodge. I already know how to do that. Oh, uh, there's a the guy right here. There we go. Get him. Just like that. Got him. All right. And I got 10 points from that. From, the, from defeating that enemies. Whatever that means. All right. What next? What is next, boys? So we defeated that guy. Whatever that means. Let's go over here. Let's uh, light, lighten this up a little bit. All right. What is this? Uh, are we supposed to go uh, here? Okay. Let's uh, find out real quick. I don't think I was supposed to go here. So... Maybe we're just supposed to light up everything, boys. Let's me light up the uh, light up the other one as well. There we go. We're lighting up every single one of those rocks. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what we were supposed to do. I had the feeling that uh, it had something to do with this big rock. All right. So now we gotta go into the middle. Let's find out real quick. Okay. So what does that do? Exactly. Okay, so now we do that and it equips the... It unlocks the door. Alright. Seems easy enough. The the fight's pretty easy. I mean, I am playing on the easiest level possible as well. So, obviously, it's going to be easy for me, boys. But still, you know. Oh, my God. Look at this game. How beautiful it is, boys. Some games, you cannot... You can't... Like, you can tell this is next level type of graphics and everything. This is the next level right there. This... It looks so good. I just can't shut up about it, boys. It's, this is fantastic, boys. It's like playing Uncharted games for the first times or something like that. Like, it, it sounds like it looks like a Naughty Dog game at some points. Look at that. A mix of Naughty Dog and the ones that did Bio Mutant and stuff. It really looks like that. Alright, can we actually slide into Rack? Okay, so we actually gotta go through there. Wasn't that interesting? Alright, what about that little one? Can I actually catch it? Interact with it? Alright, so I interacted with it. Collect that. I don't know what that's gonna give me, but uh, let's collect it really quick. Looks like we've made a new friend. Good, uh, that's good news, I guess. Find a rot. So search for more rot in the area. Okay, 
I got you. I guess I I don't know where we're gonna find those, but uh, let's find out really quick. I already know what to do right here. Let's just do that. That's gonna equip the, the whole thing, boys. There we go. Jump, double jump and stuff. There we go. All right, so we gotta find more of his uh, his kind, I guess. Make some uh, make some brand new friends. Uh, there they are. There's these guys right there, boys. The, oh, there, there's another one right here. There we go. Uh, interact with him. We got another one of them. A little bit. Oh, this is a bigger one. Is that like her mom or something? Rot found. One out of five. Interesting. So we gotta find more. And these, obviously, these little kids are gonna show me where to find those. They're gonna be. They're literally, uh, like, leading me towards these, uh, these guys. So. We're gonna, where am I gonna find more of them though? Is there some there? Oh, there we go. There we go, boys. Interact. There's another one right there. Actually pretty easy to find, to be honest. So, if you look hard enough, you can find them pretty easily. I got one, uh, another one right there. So, uh, let, let me find out. Is there any other ones that I could possibly find? Let me go through here real quick. There's gotta be one over here, right? Probably one over here somewhere, boys. Not gonna lie. There's bound to be one. Let me see really quick. Let me just do that. That's gonna equip the uh, the lighting and stuff. Doesn't seem like there's anybody right here. Let me jump. And let me go across right here. Alright, so what is this right there? What are these red lights and stuff? Oh, these are toxic to, uh, to me. Okay, so this is toxic to me right there. Collect more rot to purify the dead zone art. Okay. So I gotta actually collect the heart in order to purify these. Interesting. So where are the rots at? Gotta find them, boys. Oh, there's someone right there. Oh, I see you right there, buddy. I see you. Interact. We got another one. There we go, boys. Interact with the rot. Let me see. Dance, sneeze, kiss. Let's go ahead and dance. Let's go. Let's make a dance with them. There we go. I can actually interact with them. Let me uh, let me actually dance with them. There we go. So what's going on here? So are we dancing? There we go. Let's uh, let's go ahead and dance. No, I don't. I don't want to stand up. I don't think I can actually sneeze or whatever. I'm not sure how it works, but we'll figure it out in due time, boys. We just need one more. We need one more of them right there. Let's figure it out. Alright boys, so let me try this out really quick. There we go. If I stay and stand over here and actually jump on it, now it's actually working. I you know I used my powers and everything actually worked. So yeah, I had a feeling the other rod was going to be here somewhere. Yeah, I had a feeling that that was going to happen, boys. So okay. Yeah, this entire time I, I had to be here somehow. I just had to figure it out. So it wasn't too difficult, it just took me a while to figure out how to get there. The rock can now perform more, more actions. So your team of companions has grown and you now have a one rot action available. Press uh, this to send the rot onto objects in their environment. Collect rot to level up and gain more rot actions. Okay, got you. So that's the only way to level up is uh, collecting rots and actually, you know... Um, getting more uh, different actions that I can do via the game. So, all right, that's uh, that seems fine by me. That seems easy enough to do. So if I do this, I can't attack, but uh, boom, there we go. So now they're gonna attack, and let me go ahead and destroy this. So all of this is destroyed now. Okay, got you. But now did I lose all my rots, or are they still there? Okay, no, I, I think I still got the same amount of rots, so everything's fine. But if I want more types of attacks, I'm going to have to find more of these little guys. Okay. So I got to look around a little bit more, I guess. If I want to, you know, level up a little bit faster. Which is fine by me. I can, if I, if I want to uh, look around, I can definitely do that. So is there more of you? There's one more right here, right? Okay, so I got to jump, right? Okay, so it's telling me that I got to jump. Uh, let me uh, go ahead and leap. There we go. A little bit of parkour always helps. And uh, I guess we're climbing down right here. Anything? Nope. I don't see any uh, any enemies. Okay. We got another one of those. So let me go ahead. Oh, shit. Enemies fried in the rot. So I actually got to attack them and stuff. There we go. Let me attack them. We're going to attack the enemies real quick, boys. So 
We cannot do anything without the rocks, uh, rots and stuff. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, we're good. We're gonna be fine. All right, go, go, go. All right, so you go there, and we're gonna do that. Boom. So that's gonna be destroyed. No. Oh, he actually got me. I can only dodge. I can't block. I think so. But we got. We did destroy that. So let me go ahead and do that. Boom. That's destroyed as easily as that. And now I can go in. All right, good. Let's go, boys. We're doing very good in the first uh, on our first video right here. Let's do this shit. This game seems pretty simple so far, so we're doing really good. It seems like we might have something right here. Uh, what is this? Use the rots. So uh, now the, the rot can move certain objects in the environment. Press uh, this to have the rot pick up an object. Tell the rot where to go by aiming it. Okay. So. You go ahead and... Where do I want them to send it, actually? I'm not too sure, actually, where I want uh, them to send it. I guess if I want them to uh, move them there. So move the object right there. I guess. That's so cute, though. That, that is really cute. Cool. That's a cute thing to do. I'm not sure why I would want them to move it there, though. Maybe, you know what? Maybe... Uh, actually, not. Oh, over here. Yeah, I want you to uh, move it right there. Move it right there so I can actually jump on it and stuff like that. Got you. I got you, game. Yeah, I got you. That's pretty, that's pretty easy. Pretty, pretty easy puzzle, boys, to figure out. All right. We're true. Anybody, anybody that I can uh, interact with? I don't think so. I think we're good. And I think that's it. Can we go through here? What is this right here? All right, so uh, use the rods to move that up. Whatever that means. Oh, they're just going to move it back. I say, okay, so what do I do with that? Okay, so I good, I did a good action, I guess. And that awards me points, I'm guessing. So that's that's cool. That's cool, boys. All right, let's go. Let's jump. Woo! Almost didn't make that. We got to keep jumping, boys. All right, so now we're going to make it right there. And there we go, just like last time. And we're true. Yeah, I gotta tell you, I really love this game so far. Pretty simple game. Not a lot of dialogue. There's a boss fight waiting for us again right here. Let me help you. I can heal these spirits and restore balance to the forest. I know you are kind. You sense the power that flows through this land, but you do not fully understand it. Stay here, spirit. You must move on. You are the one who does not belong. I will never abandon my people. Oh, shit. All right, we're doing this. A giant ass tree sprout. All right, well, let's do this shit, boys. Shield, boom. You can't attack me. No, you don't. You don't at get to attack me right there. All right, let, uh, let me uh, go ahead and do that. Boom, I'm getting uh, shielded, boys, but I don't have any more shield, though. I'm gonna have to actually dodge the attacks now. Go, 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 go. Get him. No, oh my god. Woo. Gotta careful. No, shit, he's actually uh, getting me this time. Uh, every time, actually. All right, so I got it. That was actually really difficult. Not easy at all, boys. All right, attack it. Boom. There we go. And that's just like that. We destroyed that one. That was big-ass corruption right here. Mini boss fight. Pretty easy. Not too difficult. And we get another, uh, another one from that. All right, good. Oh, multiple ones as well. Alright, so they're just spawning across the place. There we go. I'm getting more. So this is basically how I level up. I just get more people. You can 
come out. It's safe now. But Sire, she cleared away the poison. The little guys can eat it. <laughs> They love it. <laughs> My name is Kayla. What are you two doing out here, alone in the forest? Don't worry about us. We've been here a long time and take care of ourselves. I can see that. You both look very strong. Do you know who that spirit was, with the horned mask? We don't know, but when he shows up, the girl's poison grows stronger. Hey, what are you doing here in the forest? I'm searching for the sacred mountain shrine. Can you take me there? And why are we looking for the sacred monster shrine right there? Of course. It's you help me. It's a you help me and I help you situation. All right. We've got another one of those side quests, classic side quests, boys. Our brother Tar was trapped deep in the forest. We need you to help him. Great idea, Saya. That'll be easy for her. Did you see what she did to that stick guy? Help us free Tar, and we'll take you to the Mount Shrine. All right. Well, I'll help you out. I'll help you out, my girl. No problem on that one. All right. Let's get all of them right there. So there we go. I just recruited all of them. I now have 8 out of 15 in order to level up for the next level, I guess. Uh, so that's how it works, I imagine. So let's just uh, continue on our way right here, boys. We're doing great so far, doing really great. Beautiful game so far boys a really good one as well good storytelling so far that I know of I mean it doesn't tell us much But uh, what we know of so far. It's a pretty good game. So we've got the map uh, situation uh, It's a diff. It's a differently uh, uh, not a, a large map or uh, by any instance uh, I think we're gonna get through that map pretty easily or we can probably uncover all of this Yeah, you can see some markers. So this map might be a lot bigger than we think it is but for now, it looks a little bit small. Upgrades. Uh, so this is where we get the upgrades and everything. Now, I have far 55 points. So I imagine how I unlock this. I don't know how it works exactly. So unlocked. How do I unlock these? So I can do a, so I can do a sprinting attack. Do I want to upgrade this? Maybe, maybe not. Uh, we got spirits as well that we can upgrade. We've got the rot. So what is that? Oh, that's kind of cool. That's like an AOE attack, a rot armor. But I need 100 points for that. Okay, got you. Oh, it tells me right there on the right, uh, upgrade available. So for 50 points, I can only upgrade this one, which I kind of tend to do already. Additional karma required. This is a good one, a parry counter. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna, just going to end up uh, doing this one, Spr uh, sprint attack light. Yeah, there we go. So I can do, actually do a sprint attack uh, light now. So that's really good. So if I do this. And uh, if I do this. Oh, I, I'm not sure actually. Yeah, well, I, I'm not sure how it works. But I think I can do a sprint attack light. It's, it's telling me to do that though. It's telling me I can, but I'm not sure how it works. So here we go, boys. We're in the land now. A brand new land. And I'm not sure where we're going, but... This place is beautiful. Oh my god. I would love to visit a place like this in real life. I gotta tell you. This is exactly the type of area I love visiting in real life. Oh, look at this. Man, this game looks beautiful. Man, this this is a screenshot in of itself, boys. This right there is just a screenshot in of itself. I mean, look at this shit. Oh, this is, looks beautiful. And... Even the, the decay, and you can see it's all bunch of decay right here. The village falling apart because of the whole the whole destruction thing. I still like it. it still looks amazing. All right, let's find out uh, how we can help out a little bit right here. How uh, how can we help out right here? Examine. I'll wait for you at the water shrine in the forgotten forest. So somebody's waiting for me. There's multiple of them right there.
All right, so my guess is I'm going to have to uh, get rid of those. So I'm going to have to get rid of the enemies first, though, because my rats are afraid of enemies. So I got to do that first. Okay, so that's done. And now I can do that. There we go. I can do that as well. There we go. Come on, come on. There we go. Just like that. That's one's destroyed. Uh, we got another one right here. Let's destroy that one, boys. Boom. Just like that. That's destroyed. And uh, there's probably more. Okay, no. This one's opening now. So the big one's opening. Is there going to be some defense on it or something that we need to do? Oh, actually not. So just like that, we just freed the village. That was easy. Art uh, at card discovered. Okay. So that's cool. And do we have anything else? So we got a village. I'm guessing it's a bunch. It's a checkpoint place where you can buy a bunch of stuff. So ca karma and upgrades. Uh, create karma by defeating corrupted enemies. Restoring the environment and finding fruit for your rot to eat. From the upgrade menu. Use your karma to unlock new abilities. Etc. Etc. Okay. Yeah. I already used my karma uh for the points and stuff so i don't have any more i do have these like diamond thingies i'm not sure what they're used for so this is the village center so we'll figure out what to do actually what is this right here let's open it really quick let's open these so these are giving me a bunch of triangle or diamond thingies and stuff like that let me collect that there we go so i'm getting that uh, whatever that means new right uh, new rod hat available. So how do I equip those? Not sure. We can warp. So this is probably a fast traveling uh, system right there. Let's open this. And uh, let's get that really quick, boys. Come on. Okay, there we go. So we got a pot. So a new uh, hat and stuff. So there's the shop. So we can equip the hats. We already have those. Let me equip uh, equip to all. So... Yeah, I think everybody's equipped. There's just one person that hasn't been equipped on or anything. Yeah, I think we're good. So just one of my uh, little, I guess, any, uh, guys that are not uh, any, uh, not done yet. So what is this place? Uh, can I go through here? I don't think I can go through here. This is a pathway that's blocked. I got to talk to these guys uh, first before going there. There is a, a one that I can collect, so that a brand new one that I can collect. There we go, got one. Just like that, that's nine right there. So I can go to all the way there. We're going to figure all this out in the next video, bro. So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this first one. Keep it easy.